Hey everybody, welcome to Mammoth Interactive's YouTube channel. First of all, I want to thank you for watching this video. And remember that this channel doesn't do Patreon, instead we sell our digital courses down below. And every single dollar that we get from the products you buy below goes into making more content. The best way to help out this channel and Mammoth Interactive is to subscribe to Mammoth Interactive's huge library of content. Get thousands of hours and hundreds of courses for a low, low price down below. We have a monthly option and a yearly option. Thanks for listening and I'll see you in the video. Hey everybody, welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to show you how to add in a female character to your level here. Now what I have done here is I have downloaded the uh, the female uh, pack here and if I do free for the month here and the specific pack that I have downloaded is this one here. And what it does is it comes with a ton of these different um, these objects here. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to basically swap out the main mesh. And this is something that's really complicated uh, to do um, unless you know how to do it. So let's hop back into Unreal here. And as you can see, we have a nice character here. But what we want to do is we just want to change the character up. Now, this just obviously doesn't work with just from male to female. This could work with any single character that you want here. So I've already downloaded that into my... Um, uh, into my project here and if you want you can take a look at the maps here now this particular uh, item here has a lot more to it now um, I just want a, a simple character to to put in here but if you go into like the maps here and you go to this third person example there's something that's a little bit more in depth here and you also notice that there is uh, you know if we just open up the third person uh, blueprint mannequin here you'll see that there is, you know, quite a bit of, of uh, variety that you can add in there. But that's not what we're looking to do. We just want to switch out this character. And it's actually way easier than it looks. So what we need to do is we need to go into the blueprints and go into our third person character, hop into the viewport. And if you take a look at this here, we need to change this up here. So I'm just going to type in female. And what I need to do is you need to figure out which one of these, I think it's just this one. Yeah. Okay. So the SK female form is the, is the one that we want. Okay. Um, and I believe there's a, um, a male form that comes with this as well. Um, and is there a male form, uh, that comes with this? Yes, there is. Okay. So it, it even, it doesn't really matter which one you do, but let's just do female here. And then maybe I'll show you the exact same process with the male here. But, but here's a problem. If you just go ahead and play, you get this wonderful, <laughs> uh, animation here. And that's, uh, well, that doesn't look good. The animations are there. So what's wrong? Well, okay. So the first, uh, the first thing that we have to do is we have to, um, change this anim class. Okay. And, this might not always work with your specific model, uh, but if I type in female here, you can see that everything's animated, and there we go. Now, if that doesn't work, there need there there's more work that needs to be done with um, with the actual uh, uh, animation and the and the bones and whatnot. Uh, but Unreal is getting better and better at just making it plug and play. And I really hope, if anyone's watching this at Epic, uh, that you know in in Unreal Engine 5, that you can just simply drop any character no matter what, and it just kind of does the, the thing for you. Obviously, easier said than done. But we can also add in a few other things here. So if I type in female uh, form here, you can see that there are different colors here, okay? And you can change your colors to whatever you want, all right? So going with that here, and you can change it to a nice gray color. Uh, but if you just put in any random, um, any random texture here, it's not going to work. And for, that's because there's more work that needs to be done in the actual texturing of the model uh, and so on and so forth. So let's do the male form one. So I just kind of want to show you how easy it is to go from one to another. And if I go to the male form, right, uh, you can also see that guess what? The anim class is not there. So we still have that same problem. You have to set the anim class. Okay. And if I type in male, uh, there we go, and look at that. And then also, if I type in male form, uh, we actually get quite a uh, female. We got the male form here, so we can make it black like so. And actually, that looks kind of neat, um, just like that here. So you can see uh, that you can basically, you know, do whatever you want here. 
Now let's go ahead and let's take this one step further. All right, so let's hop in here and uh, to the female mannequin and let's go to the materials here. And I believe if we, is it here? Here it is. It's in the body forms here. So let's, uh, you know, male gender of a form here. Let's go ahead and let's duplicate this here. And I'm just going to duplicate this. And I'm going to say this is, generally you want to keep the same kind of thing here. So I'm um, gender color. And then I'm just going to say that this is orange. Because that's exactly what we're going to do. So if we hop in and open this up here, we can change this to a nice looking orange. Kind of like so. Yeah, there we go. And push OK. Let's save that. And that actually took a lot, e it was a lot easier to save that. So let's go ahead, let's hop in here. And let's go ahead. And there we go. We now have this as orange color. And look at that, that looks pretty cool. I think that looks quite neat. Uh, so there you go. So that's how you change characters in the Unreal Engine. As usual, thanks for watching. Um, and please be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, we do need more likes and subscribers. So. That does help us out. And if you really like this channel, you can buy our digital products down below. The more money we get from the products that you buy below, the more content we can make. And if you really like this channel, you can subscribe to Mammoth Interactive's huge library of content. We release 20 to 60 hours fresh new content per month, every month. We have monthly and yearly options. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in another video.